Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Perko Twatter here, bringing you another squad builder. Uh, this week we're going for an Italian uh, Serie A team. Uh, straight into it, up in goals. Our first man is Christian Abiate from Milan. A uh, solid enough goalkeeper. Um, nothing too spectacular about him. If you can afford Buffon, by all means, go ahead. Uh, but uh, Abiate is, is a much more budget option and is a reliable enough goalkeeper. Our left back uh, from the Russian league, uh, Zenit St. Petersburg, is Dominique Crisito. Uh, decent enough player, uh, four star weak foot, I believe. Um, decent pace, all around a, a solid left back. Our first centre half is Barzagli from Juventus. Absolute monster in this game. Um, probably the cheaper version of Kalini, uh, who's probably a little bit better due to his pace, but uh, all around Barzagli is a strong option at centre half. Uh, our next our half is Domenico, or sorry, Philippe Mexes, a French international defender, plays for AC Milan. He, he's important there mainly for his um, chemistry with uh, Abiate and our right back, which uh, is <laughs> Ignazio Abate, uh, an absolute monster in um, FIFA 13. Uh, doesn't seem to have quite the same impact in. Uh, 14, uh, but still with his pace, he's always going to offer a counter-attacking threat. Okay, so up in left midfield, we have Steven El Jarawi. I never know quite how to pronounce that name. He, he's a decent enough player, as you can see. Four-star weak foot, three-star skill moves. Probably should be four-star minimum skill moves, in my opinion. Uh, a decent left w winger, um, capable of putting a good ball into the box. Uh, our first central midfielder is Thiago Mata from... Um, Paris Saint-Germain, um, four-star weak foot, three-star skill moves. He's really the more defensive option of the two midfielders, though uh, I did get a, a couple of nice little goals, but couldn't get pack away them long shots. And in midfield with him is Alberto Aquilani. I did score a couple of long ranges with him, but though nothing too spectacular. Okay, our right mid, we have Juan Cuadrado from Fiorentina. He's a Colombian international. He's an absolute beast in this game. I think it's was a 91 pace, but he's got five, four star uh, skill moves, uh, three star weak foot. Uh, funnily enough, despite costing a fraction what El Jaharway does, uh, he was my main uh, creative influence in the team. So up front there, our first striker is Mario Balotelli, the irrepre irrepressible Mario Balotelli. Um, some people complain that he's not quite so good in this game, but uh, I definitely scored a couple of crackers with him, as you'll see. His partner was Victor Ibarbo, Colombian international from uh, Cagliari. Um, an absolute beast in this game in terms of his height, his pace, his shooting. Just an ultimate target, man. Okay, guys, just before we get into the actual gameplay footage here, I wanted to let you all know that we're running a competition here at Perco Twitter. Um, once we reach 25 subs, we will be giving away um, Marouane Fellaini. Uh, so if you want to be in for the draw, please like, subscribe, comment. <laughs> okay, we'll be back with the option. Okay, guys, you can see here that's played out to Cuadrado down the wing. Beats the fullback. Gone for pace. Weak foot cross in. Balotelli. Ah, beautiful little finish there. Uh, defense could have done an awful lot better there. Goalkeeper left himself in no man's land, but still, as you can see, Cuadrado, once he gets a bit of space, absolutely lethal putting the ball into the box. Weak for cross, too, actually. As you see here, there's another through ball for Cuadrado to chase. Ball into the box, comes off for Barbo, and Balotelli, nice little volley into the corner. As I said, a lot of people are complaining about Balotelli in this game, but I did find him my main goal scorer in this game. And uh, I found his interplay here, as you can see with Cuadrado. Absolutely perfect. Back again to Balotelli. Cuts back for Cuadrado. And a finish into the corner. Very nice. Not sure if the keeper got a touch to that. Kind of looked like he might have got maybe a foot on it. Still, nice little passing move. Yeah, the keeper definitely got a touch. <laughs> Joke. Cuadrado beats the fullback again. <laughs> Never give that man any space. Cross into the box. Oh, that's going in all day of the week. <laughs> a barbo there using his height and his strength to get up. It's nice when you try and build a team that can play a bit of football, but 
Should the knees rise, you can always exploit the OP crossing too. Is <laughs> Railway there actually getting involved in play for once? Aquilani, little chip ball through the ballo. And a finish into the corner. Like I said, I cannot fault Balotelli's finishing in this game. I've had trouble with a few different strikers, but I've found Balotelli to be my most reliable. Arbo goes wide. Through ball for Aquilani. Oh, that's the yeah. That's a nice little chip from Balotelli. I forgot about this goal. Yeah, it's not a prime example of good play, but what I do love about this is just Balotelli inch perfect finish into the corner. It didn't matter if the goalkeeper was in there on his line that was going in. Here we go again. Barbo plays it out again to Quadrado. Back across and Quadrado header into the corner. Very nice. So you can still exploit the OP crossing with this team. See there, Quadrado got quite a number of assists in this game. Oh, that's it. That's the header from Thiago Mata. I only scored one goal with Mata in this <laughs> during this run. And that was it there. You'll get a better angle here on the replay. There's a nice little dink ball through from El Jarwi. Mata meets it with pace. Beautiful finish into the corner. Oh. Ah, yeah, here we go. Balotelli into a barbo. Back again. There'll be one on the keeper into the corner. Nice finish. So you can keep it on the ground and place a nice pass on the ball here. Oh yeah, here's an example now. If you want to play sweaty with this team, you can play sweaty with this team. See, so chip through for Balotelli. And back across for a barrel ball. Very nice little tap. In. I think this is much along the same lines. You can see, back to the keeper. One pass, two passes, three, four, and we're through on goal. Five finish pure sweat but just as an example guys like I said you can play sweaty with this team if you want it <laughs> 